So what is electro? Electro is all about big heavy bass lines, big kick drums around that 128 BPM mark. Maybe 130 at push or down to 126, but pretty much sitting at that magic EDM 128. And it sounds a little bit like this. Big heavy kicks, big heavy bass lines, they don't have to be too aggressive necessarily. You don't have to have a super distorted aggressive dubstep bass if you want. I mean there is certainly a subgenre of electro that deals with dubstep style basses, but it just has to have that weight and that power that well, well that you that you heard there, for example. It has to shake the air in the room. That is the spirit of electro. When you play back an electro track through big, maybe a festival speaker system or a big gig setup, a big PA system, it has to shake the air in the room and just rattle the listener to the core, to their soul. It's just so much fun. It's all about just creating crazy bass and that's pretty much it. You don't have to have nuanced percussion. You don't have to have nuanced groove or even too much crazy songwriting stuff going on. It can be quite simple. I mean, just looking at this project here, it's quite a simple, a simple genre structurally, but it does still have to have a certain energy. And most of that comes from the bass line. You need a kick. Without a kick, the whole thing falls apart. I suppose, I suppose the bass line is the, the heart of it all. Get that bass line right, and that is electro done, it's nice and simple. Literally kick, bass, a supporting clap. And that's literally it in terms of the elements. It's really cool. It's quite a nice genre from that perspective because it is so simple. And as you can see in these examples, you don't even have to have the bass line doing much of a melody. It can just be interesting sound design, interesting modulation, and then a little bit of pitch bend. And I suppose that's pretty much it for electro. The only other defining feature that I will mention is big buildups. Humongous, long, massive, crazy, energetic buildups, builds, whatever you want to call them, bits before the drop. And electro producers love to go nuts with the builds and just build up as much energy as they possibly can. Let me show you the build before the first drop in my track here. It's absolutely fantastic. It's really different, quite simple structurally but it just builds up energy and so much excitement. Imagine a DJ playing this for the first track right as a festival set is about to begin. And yeah, you, you'll get what I mean. So much energy being built up, imagine that being played for a massive crowd, people will go completely crazy. And of course, I'll show you in later tutorials exactly how I structured the build conceptually, as well as of course how I designed it from a sound design perspective, because while it does look quite simple, there's actually some quite clever stuff going on with the sound design, but as I say, I'll show you that in a later tutorial. And there you have it, that's everything you need to know about what makes Electro Electro. Thanks for watching.